Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything, for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. This is so creepy. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you! The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Can't drop any tunes right now. Keys. You eat 
like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans. <laughs> you have. St By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. And I'll back off. Rachel! I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother, but I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. Ooh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. <coughs> How you doing? Thanks, officer. I'm glad you're... Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. Now, to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? Are you fucking stupid? Get out of my space. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. How you doing, Mexi? Thanks, sir. I'm glad. You 
Well, I heard... Jesus. I don't blame... Look, Right? Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! He brought. Now back to Chloe. Are you shitting me? Watch out! Quit thinking, Max. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set, throw! Get the treat, treat boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace, but let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Damn, I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast to Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming.
You I scope doubt the area Frank is like trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. The archetypal filthy guy dishes. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or both? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers Dakota ring. Crappy wife out here. Must take him days. Is Frank going to deal online now? I could pry this vent open with the right tool. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. No more secrets. Ooh, Frank's stash. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Chloe isn't scared. She's loving this. I think the doggy likes his bone more. Can't quite picture Frank and Chloe drinking beer and hanging out. Frank must have a reason to keep a police radar nearby. I believe he would wear a collar and a furry mask. You're dumb. This is almost as good as a set of keys. My blade will open any portal. Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm, trouble in paradise. You didn't tell me you took photos of Frank in action. You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. That makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. 
Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years, my mother gloms on a stepfucker, now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. So now it's Rachel's fault too? Jesus, she was banging that pig, Frank! Bitch lied to my face, Max! I can't trust anybody again. Everybody pretends to care until they don't. Even you. Chloe Price. You better take that back. Right now. Okay. Fine. But you just don't understand. It's like I'm being punished by the universe. So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. I can tell. But look at everything that's happened the past week. Your life has changed mine, and that's not shit. I'd really love to believe that. I'd like to believe in something after what's happened. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. Rachel needs you. Oh my god, what is happening now?
Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Hint, Daddy. Yes, and we can't Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crates. I'm 18 years and old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. Breakfast. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. That's true. So how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Oh yeah, I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. My family never took fun, goofy photos like this. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work. What a with the mess tools. we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mess. That's a cool snow dough. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast you upon. You're ridiculous. <laughs> He'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where am I? I know they never took that big vacation. That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Man, I remember Chloe reading this, but not after today. I know I've seen those pictures before. Aha! You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave, play nice, try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Boom! <laughs> Like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. Uh. Listen, don't let your dad take his car to... Chloe is just so damn happy and carefree. And now I get to take a picture. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're I forgot about this. Going to work for two whales. Back what? to the lighthouse. Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. <laughs> you are ridiculous. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Ah. Uh. Do you 
remember how many eggs. Mom said it depends. Boom! Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? Listen. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. Hey, honey. I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the... I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys! Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics, you can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and joys and groceries and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Going to be wet and cold every day. But Never, like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so hard. I know. Sorry, Mad it's Max. Like You're not pissed at me, right? Right? No, it's people in Oregon Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke them peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh no, Th this is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe.
Max Caulfield. Taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe! You have a visitor! Decidí jugar sin micrófono entonces todo el capítulo por, por tema de comodidad. Pero al saber de que iba a terminar así, si salva al tipo, parece que el David no es mala persona. O sea, pero el pff, Chloe, te, no joder, macho. Qué bajona tú. Bueno, lo veremos en el siguiente capítulo. Ya con la va quedando poco para el final. <risa>